Hey guys, how's it going? In today's video, I'm going to be showing you exactly how to edit your print density for your Trophy Thermal Printer. This basically means to print either lighter or darker depending on your preference. The tutorial is for Mac users. Um, if you're a Windows user, you can watch that tutorial, but let's just get into it. So I've got my sample label here. I'm going to go ahead and click print. And as you can see, it says label uh, for my Trophy Thermal Printer. Now what you want to do is you want to click on this button that says print using system dialog. I'm in, I'm currently in Google Chrome, so uh, that's where it's printing from. And as you can see, all of these settings open up. So what you want to do is actually click on this button and you want to go to the bottom where it says printer features. Now under printer features, you're going to see print speed and print density. Print density, um, obviously the, the lower the number, the lighter it's going to print, the higher the number, the darker it's going to print. So I would recommend also in this range from 6 till 10. Just note, when you are printing on higher densities, um, it means the thermal head of the printer gets much hotter. So I wouldn't recommend printing on higher densities for long periods of time um, because obviously the thermal print head will need to cool before it can print. So it might stop your label halfway. So it's recommended print around these levels. Um, and if you really need to go here, do it once or twice, but don't have it on all the time. It's just like driving your car. You know, you wouldn't have your ga your foot on the gas pedal for the entire journey. Uh, you would obviously be slowing and start because you could blow your engine. So, similar principle, but that's and that's how easy it is to do it. So, if you have any questions, just drop a comment below and we'll get back to you. Um, otherwise, thank you for watching this video, and uh, we'll catch you in the next one.